Hey guys, D Mike here for another episode of Super Nintendo Sundays. Once again, 100% on every single level. Incredible. Pat yourselves on the back. It's time for bonus level number two. Hit that switch, baby. Once again, I don't know what to expect on any of this because. Oh boy. I'm assuming it's gonna want us to hit switches, but uh, where did the, uh, excuse me, hello? Uh, okay, uh, excuse me. Okay, this is uh, very confusing, so we'll have to probably rely pretty heavily on the flutter jump to not die. I don't really know. Okay. Could that just, uh, oh, is this good? Is this good? How do we get up to that one? Oh, <laughs> okay. I've got a feeling that this is going to be, uh, as good as it looks already. We'll say that. Come back. Hello? Sir? Ma'am? No, no, no! <laughs> oh man. So it begins. Last time I recorded this, I gave myself a little bit of a, uh, a little help with the amount of lives I provided. Unearned lives, we'll say that. Okay, so I'm just starting to kind of get the gist of what this is asking me to do. Okay, so it looks like it comes back. Oops. Okay. That kind of sucks. Like, you have to really... You got to get it the first try. I think it's supposed to be like a sequential thing where you hit it, it comes back, you jump on it, you get launched. All the way up here. Oh, give it to me. <laughs> oh boy. Everything is going swimmingly. 100% intentional and planned. Are you having fun, viewers? Are you enjoying yourselves? I know I am. This is one of those few games that I will tolerate a little bit of punishment. It is just so fun and cute that it's okay by me. That's typically how the world works. The things we do for the things we love. All right, so, oops, I did it too soon, but, oops. I don't know how much momentum you need. I'm just kind of curious what is the rest of the way. Another platform over there. So that's where we're headed next. We'll basically wind up in the same territory as last time, where I'm going to give this three good chunks of tries. And then uh, if I can't quite figure it out, which is highly likely that I will... There we go. All right, where's the platform? Okay. Oop. So I do not care about anything besides... Oops. Getting out of here. Oh no. Oh boy, what have I done? Oh, does that count? Oh, guys, I did it! Oops. <laughs> Alright. Well, this was... This is a little anticlimactic. I thought it was going to take me more tries than that. And there's no boat. <laughs> okay. I was not intending to do this. 100%. Once again, incredible. Incredible. Okay, so well, since that kind of was a little bit anticlimactic, let's go ahead and uh, let's do some World 3 then. You're getting a bonus and you're getting World 3. Wow. You're welcome. Welcome to Monkey World, aka my life. Yes, this was one of those. Ooh. Is that Kiki from Link's Awakening? Ooh, can you can we eat the monkey? <gasps> we can eat the monkey. 
That sounds kind of suggestive. Hey, what do you want to do this weekend? Yeah, I'm just going to go eat some monkey. I actually do remember I was on a trip with my family, and we had gone to a Brazilian steakhouse. Now, for those of you wondering, no, I was not in Brazil. I was in Mexico. Good old Mexico with me familia. And, uh, yeah. Went to the steakhouse. It was delish. But one of the things that was really weird was that we were offered a bunch of different types of meats. I think that's kind of... The, oh, wait. Is the, where is the ground? Oh, is, is the ground wet? What are we stepping in? It's swampy? Anyway, so we'd gone to this steakhouse and... Wait, can I get there? I wanna... Oh, excuse you. No, stop! Quit it! Okay, this looks pretty solid. Whoop, there we go. I'm not trying to avoid grabbing things, I'm just trying to survive. What is that? Is that a fish? I don't really necessarily care for the amount of... Mushroom... Not mushroom, watermelon... Oh, wow. Watermelon power-ups I'm getting here. Kinda just want... The regular eggs? But anyway... So, we've gone to the steakhouse, and they offered us just kind of regular stuff, like chicken, steak, pork. And then eventually they're like, does anybody want to try monkey? Does anybody want to try rabbit, which they called a boogs boonie? Which I thought was very funny, and I enjoy their accents about it. Oops, come here. I don't know if it legitimately was monkey or not, or if they were just messing with us. Just a group of... Casual Americans hanging out in Mexico. They probably were just giving us a, uh, they're joshing us. That's what I'd have to guess. Because if not, I don't know. I feel like monkey is not really a meat. Oops. I feel like monkey is not really a meat that you can just casually get. I could be wrong, though. Puts us back a little bit. Not cool. All right, let's get our bearings here. Really tired of monkeying around. Ooh, monkeying around here. Nope. Kind of wonder what makes it Monkey World. Like, and like you don't really see this in any of the other Mario games. Monkeys aren't really like a a frequent enemy. Although, I mean, in Galaxy Two, we did just fight the uh, well, not fight, but we were challenged by the chimp. Oops. Very cool. Just trying to get back up to the top of this mountain. Bonk that piranha, get out of here. Yes. This game in certain instances, oops. This is what I get for trying to brute force it. The game's like, no. You will play our way or else. Or you will get hit by monkeys throwing water. I think I fell in that same exact spot. Oops. That's okay, we weren't really that far into the level anyway. That's a game over, nobody wants that. I would love to continue, thanks. Let's get back on the horse, or the Yoshi. Back in the saddle, we're at it again, everybody. Here we go. Come here. Not super concerned with perfection here. The only perfection are you viewers. That's right. Perfect in my heart. And peanut butter and chocolate. The other perfection in the entire world. I feel like it's kind of interesting how like I thought peanut butter as a substance as a food or as a lubricant or whatever you're into wasn't really that polarizing of a thing but I've learned in like recent history. I mean obviously if you can't have it because you know it will kill you, then I totally get it. But for like, you know, in a more cash environment. The amount of people that I've learned in recent history are like, very anti-peanut butter. I thought it was really interesting. Wasn't expecting it to be that high. You know, in my experiences, there's certain things like peanut butter goes really well with, and there's other times where I'm just not really into it. But I like it as an overall kind of addition to something. Maybe not like the prime, or primary, the primary flavor. But I was hearing about people who don't like peanut butter at all. And I'm thinking like, man, that's such a nutty attitude. Oh man, stop throwing your gosh dang balls at me. 
give you guys a fun fact. If you're living in the U.S. and A, the state vegetable, I'm going to be very direct when I say this, the state vegetable of, of Oklahoma is the watermelon. So, how does that make you feel? If you're confused, that's probably fair. Okay, so like all eat what can eat. Okay, so I thought that was gonna be like a fun little swing. We could jump on, nope, just the game being rude. Okay, yeah, this is kind of uh, oof. I don't know how you're supposed to avoid that. Ooh, and they even try to take Mario. What a bunch of jerks. We get a bonus this time, maybe? It's been a while since we've had one. Nope, not looking good. Nope, I could have gotten another one of those flowers, but survival was my MO. But once again, I don't know how I keep doing this. Like, I've never played these levels before, but it's 100% every single time. It's kind of incredible. So here's Jungle Rhythm. Get your Jungle Boogie on. We got plenty of shy guys with spears. Looking kind of a little questionable. I'm gonna just bonk them back. Not sure if they really thought this one out, but then again, it was the 90s. So things were a little different, but what is this? Ooh, I like that key. Well, you can get them as long as they're not pointing their spear at you. Oh, I see. Okay, so if you bonk into these platforms. They turn into... or into these boxes, they turn into platforms. I see. Gotcha. That's a nice little mode of transportation. Now all these guys again. Ugh. Keep always forgetting that you can't, uh... Is that...? Ugh. You can't bonk them. Can I... Can I just lick you until you go away? That's probably not something you should say casually. What if I just lick you until you go away? Is that a deterrent? Has that ever worked for anybody? I don't know if I want to find out. I'm kinda scared. Okay, so these platforms come in multiple varieties. Looks like it's pink and blue. Is there something up there? Oops, okay. I have this key and I want to do something with it, but I don't know. Oh boy. Save me, Flutter Jump. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not seeing it yet. I feel like it's like on the wrong, the wrong cycle here. Yeah, I don't, I don't think I can get that. So I'm not going to try. Oh, I guess I have to. It is not letting me go down. How do I do this? I can't get eggs from the bottom. Eggs? From the bottom. Ooh, there's a blue platform. There it is. I see it. I see it! I see, said the blind man as he picked up his hammer and saw. That's what one of my teachers said when I was in school. That's a joke. Oh no! No! Ooh! Oh. That was making me pretty nervous. Alright. Yeah, the, uh... Oh, come on. Let's get up there, please. Thank you. Thank you so much. Okay. Guys, we're fine. It's okay. Stop your whining. I hear a... One of the rotating platforms. Probably gotta hit both of these, if I had to guess. We're doing pretty well with the, uh... Whole flowers thing, so that's a good chance of us getting a bonus this time. I think we have three or four of them. For those of you who love bonuses. Flooding my inboxes with d -Mike. Why aren't you getting bone? Okay, that doesn't actually happen. But if it did happen, that's what people would say. I guarantee it. Are we close to done? I feel oh, look, they're dancing. I think, oops, oops. That's what I get for trying to do that. I don't know where the coin door is. I'm not super concerned about it either. Okay, okay. There we go. Perfect. End the level. 100% on flowers. Good chance we're going to get a bonus. Here it is. All right. Oh. Okay. Well, I guess it wasn't meant to be. 
But once again, 100%, perfect work. You guys are superstars. And that's all the time we have for today. So today's episode a little unexpected, but I hope you enjoyed yourselves. I've been D-Mike. This has been Super Nintendo Sundays. And I'll see you next time. Bye.